really, really solid, good player. Took a, he's been taking good games off of really top players, and once again, ZVT. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna scout better. We're not gonna fall for that cheesy shit, and we're gonna win with good fundamental macro stuff. Right? Yep. Yep. Exactly. Good. An extra right. open. That's okay. We are about okay. to expand. Yes. A little bit delayed because of the extra overlord. Yeah. If you catch that kind of thing, that might be the one time that we're okay with canceling a larva. Okay. And we definitely want to get that pool down soon, and you did not drone scout, you're going to want to. And uh, when do you build your gas on your 15 hatch? 21 supply. Between 21 and 25. Okay. Still droning. Luckily for you, we don't have to make the 17 overlord. Still building. That doesn't necessarily mean anything. Pool's done, Direct. so you, you want to get lings out. You want to get some guys transferred down to your natural. You want to start a queen in your natural. You don't know what he's doing, so you have to prepare for the worst. That means starting a spine crawler in your natural and getting lings and that okay. queen. So oh, and transfer. He loses overlord. That's a big deal. Yeah. At least I made that extra one at the beginning, right? Yep. So, Zergling, oh, you can't make any more than you have, so Overlord, 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 Overlord. And you're just going to kind of chill out for a bit until you feel safe. Queen. And look, look at here, you've got a bunker going up. you got to bring all your drones and your lings, no, all your drones at the same time. Back up lings, back up lings, back up lings, back up lings. Back up, back up. Now go with the drones. you got to keep it all together. got to keep it together. got to keep it together. Ah! Are you focusing the bunker? I don't like bunkers. <laughs> bunkers can't kill you. Marines can. That is phenomenal. Okay. Oh, you have 12 lings on the way. Don't let that overlord float back to where the marines are. Yeah, focus that SCV. Very good. Dang it. Come on. Everything together here. Oh, good surround. Queen would be much better served punching marines and not the uh, bunkers. There you go. There you go. All right. So I think you're out of the woods here. Why are Why are marines coming from that angle? Run your queen. Uh, run your queen. 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 There you go. Send that queen up to the main. Start a new queen in your natural. Send all those links to see if there is, in fact, a proxy over there, and you need to get back to droning. No more Zerglings. You're down to 10 drones, but he's only at 12 SCVs. 
Oh, and it was a proxy, so send you guys across the map, drones and overlords. I hear my overlords out in the middle. Do you remember what happened last time a building floated by your base? Uh, it landed in in my base. So. <laughs> so what can we do to ensure that that does not happen again? Follow it with a circling or two or three, and that works. Make sure I have map vision with my overlords. Also, I need yes. you to establish some map control. Okay. Need gas, so and you need to continue droning. I might even double gas at this point, because we're kind of far into the game. And see how much of a difference that one overlord being right where it is makes? Yeah. If you were to land that, you would see it. All the rest of your lings. These lings are doing nothing in your natural. If they're in okay. his natural instead, they're at least denying an expansion. Got it. Mine from the gases. Continue droning. Continue making overlords. I am regularly seeing nothing happening on your production tab. That should never be the case. Got it. So two overlords, drones. Your money's stacking up. You can put down a hatchery if you want it. You might even want to poke up that ramp and see what you can see. Not with all your lings, but just with a couple. Okay, tech lab, command center, and some marines. Start your ling speed. Uh, you're starting your layer, so let's go double Evo and let's take our fourth gas, third and fourth gas, and you need to continue making drones. Be careful with your, with your lings here. Careful, 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 careful. Uh, uh. Alright, so th th these guys are seeing a lot of marines, right? Yeah. So, bane lings would be a good idea. Yeah, bane lings might help. I think infestors is still your best bet. Got it. I need a huge round of drones here. Just listen, you, you can't... There you go. Thank you. Alright, use those two guys <laughs> to cover both of those exits to his natural. Okay. Control both towers. And still, having these guys all the way back at home doesn't do anything. Mine from the gases in your natural. Start an infestation pit. That's a whole lot of marines. Yeah. All right. So do you need spine crawlers? Do you need lings? You need something. He's starting to push. He's starting to contest map control. So you have to be making units. Spin, spin, spin. Get, get, get your stuff up in the front of your natural. Look, there he is. He's on your creep. You got to bring everything at once. Queen included. Back up, back up, back up. You just stem. Alright, so run your drones away, run your drones away, run, run your drones away! Oh okay. my god! What do we say about engagements? You can only engage when you can what? Win. You can overwhelm him. So he's very, very low on health because he's been stimming a lot, so... You gotta go with those drones, it's like all you got. Alright, not while he's stimmed, though. Okay, this control is terrible. making me sick to my stomach. <laughs> Okay, take a breath. A couple overlords. 
it makes you feel any better, uh, he only has three Marines right now. <laughs> that does make me feel better, thank you. Okay. I'm pretty sure that he literally did not make a single unit while he was macroing there. So rebuild your infestation pit. Oh, he sniped that, didn't he? Let's reposition those spine crawlers so that they're relevant. Queens might be a good idea. Lots and lots of something. You have no vision of the map. You have no idea what's coming. Damn. Okay. No, 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 no. Why did we lose this game? Um, one big thing, one big detail was the cause of this. That's a good question. Um, no map control. Bunch of idle time. No, 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 no. All of it comes down to your engagements. Every every single time you fought, you fought with half your army, and you didn't engage in one big ball. Okay. So what we're gonna do here is uh, let's go ahead and GG out. And I'm gonna do it one more time. I think we have time for one more game. And you can do this. So you've already done it one time perfectly, and then every time after that, it's just you, you're. I think I don't know if you're getting a little tired or a little worn out, but it's getting a little sloppier and a little sloppier and a little sloppier. So let's kind of just take one big deep breath, okay? All right. Uh, this game. And you'll probably roll Zerg this game, which would be appropriate. Um, I bet he rolls Terry again. <laughs> oh, Revenge wants to go random. All right, that's fine. Of course, Revenge is top 200. But uh, regardless, when we fight, we have to be decisive, all right? And one all thing right. that um, one thing that kind of killed you, uh, and that has killed you on multiple occasions, uh, all of the Zerg units, not all of them, but all of the ones that we've been making, at least, uh, all right. they're, they're melee units. They don't have a whole lot of range. Uh, roaches have really short range. Hydra's range is okay, but Zerglings obviously have no range, and uh, Banelings have no range. We haven't really been making many Banes either, but this is important. Lings, melee unit. Marines, ranged unit. So as such, when a Zergling engages a Marine, the Zergling takes damage as it approaches, and it'll take damage again as it retreats. Right? Right. So when a Zerg army engages a Terran army, you're taking you're receiving damage as you engage, and if you decide to disengage, you're going to be receiving damage as you leave. This is actually something that we cannot afford to do. We cannot afford to take that coming and going damage. Because okay. in the process of moving in and out, just that little bit of time, as you push forward and as you go back, results in you losing half your army, I promise. It is, it's, it's catastrophically bad. So, uh, the lesson here, and it's twofold. One, when you commit, that is it. All right? Okay. When you start to attack, there is no leaving. You go once and you go hard. And two, make sure that when you commit, you're big enough and you're bad enough and you have enough stuff to win. So no engaging in a losing battle and no changing your mind halfway through. Once you go, that's it. All right? All right. All right. Let's do it. 
soon as revenge says go go we will go go